No cut price war would be complete without something from the Eastern Bloc. So cue Skoda's Octavia, which sneaks in a 169 kilowatt drivetrain in its sedan body with the RS badge. At 41 grand, it's priced high, but will put up a fight regardless. Out on the track, the Skoda feels like it's a long car, like a big car. It just hasn't got the poise, it hasn't got the suspension tuning to suit a hard day out on the track. I think the value component is going to play against it as well. It's, it's $40,000, so it's pushing towards the top end of that budget group. Skoda RS, one minute 42.4. It rides the curbs nicely, it's, it's good gearing, it's a good engine, everything like that. Probably the biggest disappointment is just not being able to turn the electronics all the way off and the, and the traction control still wanting to kick in. So up through all the tighter sections, it really does limit the sort of the drive off the corner. It's one of those cars where you, you think it's going to be a little bit better than ultimately what it is. It, it still does a great job out there, it's just kind of a, just not quite where it needs to be. The Skoda Octavia RS230 is a terrific road car. I think it's a little bit out of its depth here. Uh, as a track car, it sort of it doesn't really want to turn in as hard as, as you would like it to, but uh, on the road, it's exceptionally good. It rides very well, it's well equipped, and for 41 grand, I mean, it is some kind of bargain. So sneaking the Golf GDI performances engine into a Skoda sedan wins instant points with me for sleeper factor. It does feel a little bit understeer on the way into corner and you can really neutralize that with that front locking diff, which is quite impressive. Skoda Octavia RS230, this is a fantastic car on the road. It's a car that is sort of best enjoyed at eight tenths. It feels like there's a great chassis there that just wants to be exploited on, on the track. It, it feels like the car wants to be thrown around, but you sort of can't because of the electronics. Look, as a road car, the Octavia RS for the money is fantastic. It's got plenty of performance, plenty of comfort. It looks fantastic inside as well. So this may be not the right format for it to show its best light. <laughs>